Yeah. I, uh, I mean, there's no real way around it. When you have to make a quick recovery, it'll expose you if you're not in shape. Um, most people can play a match and it's fine. It's the recovery where it kind of defines you. And, um, you know, there, there are a lot of positives out of this week. I feel healthy. You know, I, I played matches and I was running, you know, uh, hard. Um, my lack of any sort of fitness regime, um, you know, on, on my leg is, 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 is apparent, but that's something that is a matter of work. It's not a matter of, of health. That's something that's in my control. Um, I, di I just didn't, didn't have, have it physically. It got to about four all and I was, you know, I'm, 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 I'm out of shape. That's it. Um, you know, so, uh, that's that, yeah, that, I mean, that's, that's, that's it. I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. Um, you know, that I'm, I'm professional enough to, to take care of. Um, you know, you can't, you can't lie, uh, you know, to, to your body, you know, you, and, and that's just it. I, I've, I've, you know, it's been a, it's been a tough three, four months start. You know, uh, when I first got hurt in Australia, they said, uh, you know, it'll be six to eight weeks and I played San Jose in three. And, uh, now we're looking at about seven or eight weeks and I'm starting to feel better. So, <laughs> you know, um, my tennis has come around a, lo a long way in the last, Two or th two weeks, maybe three weeks. Um, I feel a lot more. Ca I'd rather have this scenario than, um, you know, being hurt and not knowing about the tennis. My 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 tennis has felt a lot better. Um, you know, there's a lot of progress. Now it's a matter of of, of yeah. I, I feel good enough where I feel like I can put in the work uh, away from the court and and uh, get my legs back back under me um, as far as strength and, and, uh, and, and fitness. Um, to be honest, Peter, it's going to depend on how I, how I feel in two or three weeks. You know, if I, if I can get the work in and, uh, and do what I need to do. But right now my priority is, is uh, you know, I feel like there is a little bit of a window to, to get right, and I, I'm playing a, a very, very heavy summer schedule um, from Queens Wimbledon pretty much straight through the U.S. Open. So, um, you know, I'm going to go when I feel fit and, and, and ready, and, uh, you know, uh, you know I, I'm certainly going get, to get some in before, before the French, um, that's for sure. But my priority from tomorrow on is, is – is getting in shape, dropping weight, and building strength. Yeah, one ask about, I don't know, I know you don't look ahead, but Marty Fish would have been next, and he was saying before how much fun it would have been to guys, especially with friends and all that. Had you thought about that, like that you would have maybe had a chance to play each other in a big match? Yeah, I saw, I, I saw it. Um, but I, it's not much to it. I mean, we've done it 12, 13 times before. Um, you know, the, the scenario is always the same. Um, you know, we've we've always been very close. I think it's a little bit more intriguing now, just because the tables have turned a little bit more, and he he's the top guy, and I and I'm not. Um, so that probably lends itself to being a little bit more of a popcorn match in that regard. But as far as as far as we go and the dynamic of uh, of our match, it's always hard, you know, to play someone that you're that's like a brother to you. Um, but you know, even after he finished and I was going to go on, and we were hanging out in the locker room for an hour. I mean. That, I think drop date is, you know, about an hour before the match, we probably wouldn't have been too chatty. But, um, you know, I, I always cheer for him.